you're happy because we're so big. <laughs> Fucking stupid. Hey. 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 Want to hear the most annoying sound in the world? Shut the fuck up. I mean, that, ca that camera for Justin is probably the best option right now. <laughs> it kind of looks cool. Yeah, I mean, it's the best. <laughs> Dude, all the other ones had, like, no, uh, I was, like, talking to him through a Capri Sun. Like, not good. <laughs> I'm dumb. I'm tired. I'm so, uh, I've been up for, like, so long. <laughs> Wake the fuck up, everybody! <laughs> Unoriginal content. Can you zoom out on me a little bit? What? Can you zoom out on me just a smidge? Zoom out on you? Yeah. Yeah. I thought you were talking to me. Yeah. There you go. Don't, don't, don't worry about it, Justin. I would not. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck is up? <laughs> oh, God. Welcome to another episode of HMHD, Heavy Music, Heavy Dads Podcast. I am RJ Drew. I've been up for like 29 hours. Drew's been up. I'm tired. <laughs> a little more than a day. It's going to be it's gonna be wild. We would have done it on Saturday, but I had to work last Saturday on a different shift. So yeah. in order, so we didn't uh, miss a week, you know, but yeah, yeah it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. And as always, behind the booth is the booth, bitch boy. <laughs> and, uh, I like how Justin's, Justin's, early, Justin's been so grumpy today. <laughs> what? You came in hot. What are you talking about? You came in attacking hey. him. Hey. We were having a great time. And you're just like, you oh, you're going to be on your phone the whole time? You want to come and hang out? It's like, dude, you just got here. <laughs> Tiptoeing through the garden. <laughs> pretentious. <laughs> oh. um, you want to play pretentious? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, I'm about to leap over the fucking dance, dude. Don't do that. Yeah, it's been a long time on it. Fuck out of I'm here, right dude. here, I'm dude. Little <laughs> shit out I'm of I'm right here. here. Hey. In 1953, the U.S. government. Sorry. What? <laughs> yeah, I've been watching it. CIA drug money. It's there. <laughs> mm. That's cool, man. Hi, everybody. I'm, uh, yeah. I'm, I got a second win, though. I'm excited. I, I got good music today. Yeah. I'm just, uh, Anyway, we've got some cool things. We're going to go see the Edex show. Daytona. And we're going to stop by Rite Aid for some uh, heartburn medication. <laughs> I took some before I got here, so I should there you go. kick in. Uh, I messaged the, the lead singer of Edex. I'm going to bring him a shirt. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that's going to be cool. I'm excited, though, because... Um, it's a big bill. It's yeah, a, well, it's like six bands on there. Well, I was, that was what I was talking to Justin about before you got here was there was a... So they had, like... Obviously, they were on tour with Wisdom, Wisdom and War, but they... I haven't, I didn't see the actual Daytona show, like flyer. Right. So our buddy posted it because he's playing with Coagula. And I was like, damn. <clears throat> but then I saw in the opener, like Return to Pain. I was like, oh, fuck. Yeah, you're, you're <sighs> talking about that. I love Return to Pain, dude. That band, we played them a couple episodes ago. Man, they're so good. Yeah. Um, obviously, I'm stoked for Edict, too. And, you know, all the men's going to be really good. But have you been to this venue before? Never even heard of it. Um, I was talking to Kyle. What's it called? Tira Na Nagu or Tira. Tiramisu. Yes. That's a uh, Italian dessert. <laughs> <laughs> uh Kyle uh Shepherd is talking. Uh tell me about it this morning and uh it's gonna be pretty pretty intimate, pretty violent. That's cool. Yeah. I like that. It's basically like the size of Will's if you just stopped it out the back and went to the bar kind of deal. So oh, he wow. made it yeah. it's gonna be Yeah, it's gonna be cool. Pretty nutty. I'm excited about it. Yeah. So. Uh Andy's gonna go. Uh yeah, I'm grateful Justin's not going. That's cool. <laughs> I, I, I might still go because I'm ridiculous, but <laughs> yeah, I guess that depends if I go or not. So we'll figure it out. Um, <laughs> I'm just gonna beat the fuck out of Justin today, dude. I'm just gonna. <laughs> I don't know why I'm feeling so much animosity towards him right now. You're threatened. Why are you on your phone? I was looking up the flyer. You fuck. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Where Where is it? Well, Rock actually, and roll, it's actually, McDonald's. No, it's not on Edict's page, <laughs> believe it or not. Yeah. I know. Um, so yeah, watch me find it first. Uh, that's fine mm. if you fight it. We're on the same. We're team. already off the rails. We're on the show the same team, dude. <laughs> no, we're not. Okay, we're playing different sports. Right. though. Well, um, hope you got good music today. Turn a nog. Turn a nog. It's three different things. That's what it is. Sorry. Turn a nog. All right, I'll be there. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be there on Friday. And the show is. Started. Yep. <laughs> Very good. Oh, we've already been recording, aren't you? I know. 
I know. Okay. We played the intro. Is I, that what that noise was on my headphones? <laughs> <laughs> Beat the fuck out of Jaws. And Between the extreme exhaustion and, and the two beers, like, goddamn. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> What's, what, what do you want to do? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. You know what? Fuck it. This is why we do morning episodes. Play some music. Okay. Uh, okay. So my first band. <laughs> uh... So this band's called uh, Deal with God. <laughs> Fuck you. Th- that I, is that one of your bands? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, oh, yeah. go ahead. What's the so, uh, Apparition. You chose Apparition. Okay. Yeah, they're from Syracuse. They're fucking killing it right now, okay. and it's good shit. <laughs> It's almost like you can sense when the foot is going to hit your face. And you're doing right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. A new balance. And then again there. <laughs> One more right here. You ever had a new balance foot right on your face? <laughs> Size 12 and cross. You <laughs> That bass is so fucking raw, dude. That's so good. That's it. Woo! Hey, what was the name of the band? Deal with God. Deal with God. That's sick, dude. Yeah. I, I know they're kind of... They're bigger than I, I think they are, but they're... I forget what label they're on, but there have been on a lot of cool shit. I've been seeing them all over the internet, so I'm like, well, well, fuck it. Yeah, they're good. So let's play them. <laughs> that shit's rad, dude. Yeah. Stole another one off my list, man. Did yeah. I really? Yeah, yeah, I was like, oh, I'm, I'm going to hold on to this because it's fairly new. You found it pretty quickly. Is it new? I mean, I know, yeah, it, yeah, yeah. I know it was released not too long ago, like a couple weeks ago, but. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> good shit. <laughs> this is so dumb. Can you angle my camera down a little bit? It's. There it is. I could just slowly glide back. I, well, <laughs> we have we uh, spare no expense. Jurassic Park, uh, you know. Hold on. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Okay. I like that. Let me tighten it up. Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, dude, this is fun. Yeah. So what's new, guys? Anything fun? Um, I mean, you had to save me yesterday. I had a fucking embarrassing moment at the gas station to where oh, yeah. uh, 7-Eleven <laughs> tried to do a holding fee like five times. It all came back this morning. Mm. But like there was like something weird with their their uh, their systems were down or something like that. And I tried to go into two different 7-Elevens. I tried to go to two different gas stations and it happened to be 7-Eleven. But then like when I went to the other one, I had three miles to empty. I'm like, I'm going to fucking like, there's no way. Which and you I, think you, you like you're confident, but then you're like, no, 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 no. <laughs> what I was worried about was is that I was taking my nephew to T ball, so I needed to drop him off. So I'm like, um, oh, dude, my glass, the glass of my, oh, anyways, uh, <laughs> sorry. No, this is my watch I wear all the time, right? And it, Wait, the, there's no glass on the top. Where's the X? Huh? That's a different watch. Oh, <laughs> this is my grandfather's watch. The, oh, so the, the, the eyelet or the lens came out? Yeah, there's no glass there. Ooh. I just noticed that. That's weird. Hopefully it's in my kitchen because that's where I hang it up. Anyway, so I, what I didn't want is the, a memory of his to be pushing our my car. So like, so uh, oh. <laughs> I, I, I didn't want him to it be gives, like, oh, I remember that time. Give him some grit though. Yeah. You help me now. Push. The, you better push that goddamn car. <laughs> I was trying to be so cool. I was trying to be so cool because I was like, I'll just go pay inside. And guys like cash only. I'm like, I don't have any fucking cash. I was just like so pissed. I was like, so I called you. Yep. Mm, okay, bye. Give me twenty bucks, and uh, gave me some gas. Thank, yeah. thank you for gas. That's fucking out. wild, dude. That happens all the time. Where I'll go to the gas. But station. you said that, like you were on the way over, and it was being weird to Same you. Thing, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> so I don't know if it's like a server thing because it, it's just coincidental that it was at two Seven Elevens. Yeah, three actually. So 
And so I go in and I put the thing and I say, oh, leave a card in there. And it's like, go through the cashier. I'm like, God damn it. You know, yeah. whatever. But I feel like that happens all the time yeah. lately. I don't know, but maybe it is a 7-Eleven server thing. I don't know. I, I know think what all... it was weird, because it like the guy told me, he's like, yeah, so like it it holds like $125. And then it returns once the, the sale is complete. Right, right. And so when I did it the first time, it just like, it just like kept it in there and it, it just says like processing and it just took for, it was like a two minutes. I was mm -hmm. like, huh. So I took it out and then it like glitched weird. I'm like, oh fuck. Dude, I have people steal my debit card like two times a year. It is so frustrating that I have Wait, to. How does that happen? I don't know, dude. I don't know. <laughs> dude, it pisses me off to where I'll just get like, dude, the last time it happened, it fell off my bike. Okay, well that makes sense. When it when I was and oh, the guy that, okay, went to I like understand that. That makes dollar sense. store. That what happened what what was that? Six, eight months ago or whatever? Mm -hmm. Oh shit, that's right. I forgot about dude, that. Dude, that pissed me off, dude. I was like walking up and down 520, like I'm gonna be the I, fuck no, out of somebody. I, I really, <laughs> like what's up? I remember when that happened. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and like they literally took my card. My the my wallet fell out and everything out. And when I made was a U-turn, the wallet, right? They tried to use yeah, yeah that's right. They okay. went to they went to that dollar store. That's and cool. I got like a notification from the German guy. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> they, I got a notification that they were trying to use like six hundred dollars at dollar store or something. What like are you that. buying? Like, okay, what the? like I he understand. must have just got a cart and just went like this, <laughs> dude. dude like, what are you buying? Just a suit of or like what the fuck are you buying? Like, I feel like it'd be hard to spend six hundred dollars. I got a bunch of Jolly Ranchers and cheese puffs and what did you get? A metric ton of it. I literally was like. <laughs> I, I, dude, <laughs> my, I grabbed my wallet. I'm like looking, I was like, I'm in the middle of 520. There's cars going by and there's like a bus stop. And I see a bunch of like homeless looking, like non-housed people like there. And I'm just like, non-housed. I go, who's got my, <clears throat> I'm alive. I'm like, yeah, who, who's got my debit card? And you're like, I don't know. I'm like, one of you guys have my debit yeah. card. Dude, I was pissed. Yeah, I was like, but my bank is really good. Uh, Everything was credited back to me, but it's also you get to play that game for like a month. Like, what was tied to this card? You know, like oh, dude, that's you know, the, that's like, the fucking word. I absolutely, and that's what I hate more than anything. Like, take my money. I don't want to have to re-sign up or change my card. And like, you like sign into Hulu long day, and you're like, ah, fuck, dude, no, dude, that, you is, got my Hulu that, is, that is the worst because then it's like it pisses me off, dude. Yeah, that's the fucking worst. I remember. Uh, see, my bank is cool because if I lose my debit card, I can you can get it the same. I day. can walk in there and in five minutes I have a new one. Yeah, which is cool. But then, like you said, you're playing that game. Same thing with like passwords. So like, yeah, I I don't know what my Google password is, but it's stored in my computer, <laughs> right? And it's stored in my phone. So then when I try to, like, I went to the salon today to uh, print some stuff out, mm -hmm. but I had to get on the administrator account, which okay. is cleaned out because I, it's not my computer anymore. So I had to re-log into Google. So I have to go through, like, 80 forms of fucking identification, <laughs> yeah, no, verification. And I'm just like, dude, it's me. Like, you can have my fucking email. I don't care. Like, it doesn't matter to me. <laughs> but, yeah, that that is the worst. I, I don't know what's worse. Changing your email password or losing a debit card. They're both equally pretty <laughs> shitty. Dude, they make you jump through hoops, it's, man. It's like, stop. Just like, I'm glad. Put a fucking know. chip in my brain and just like, let's scan it. Like, I'm so over like <laughs> all this. Like, are you a robot? No, dude. You can email him at RJ. Uh, I do not want that. <laughs> yeah, <man. laughs> you can have that. Put it, bit. put, put the fucking chip in my brain. Dude. Whole Foods tried to do that. P put chips on people? Mm -hmm. Like in their hands or something? Yeah, so they yeah. can have like their own fast pass checkout. <laughs> Look it up. It's not my line. It doesn't doesn't so, um doesn't it, Am it happen? Doesn't Amazon have a store like that where they like, they know what you put in the Called cart? China. No, stop. <laughs> they they know what you put in the cart and you just like it already like as you walk out it charges your card. There's like no. I, I wouldn't be surprised if there was because RFID chips are like a thing. So it's yeah. like it's the same thing as your your you know the little chip in your card. Like that's why they sell wallets with the RFID blockers because people can go around with like a scanner and just. It's tight. They yeah. get it. Yeah, man. Sick. I used to work with a guy that was so paranoid about that shit. Every time we go to a gas station, he'd almost like take a screwdriver and like <laughs> break it, like just to make sure. Well, we worked in Miami. Yeah. So it yeah. made sense. And actually, one morning he found one. That's awesome. And I was like, no shit. I was like, God. I mean, you know what yeah. happens, obviously, but yeah, like, yeah, you, know, yeah. you don't think about it around him. But it's like, he was like, it dude, always you, happens at gas stations. He's like, dude, you have to lock your passenger side door when you're pumping gas because they'll open the door and grab your phone and fucking go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> God damn, it's just an iPhone. Yeah. You right. Thirty dollars for it. <laughs> yeah. Now nowadays it ain't worth nothing. Yeah. Well, Everyone's then, got one. I know. But then again, I'm not in that position. So what do I know? <laughs> I don't know. No, Drew, I can I can blow your mind right now. I can I can give you your own Google password if you have an iPhone, and you don't have to remember it. 
it's if it's saved in there, you just type in passwords in your settings, and then you could type in Google, and then it'll give you your Google. I'm not app. doing that live on the air. I'm not telling you. That. <laughs> I'm just saying. Like, yeah. Bring it up, Justin. <laughs> Put it on the screen. <laughs> I use incognito. There's nothing you're gonna find. <laughs> <laughs> now, I, I, you know, I, I will retouch on the fact that like we normally do, we've been doing it on Saturday mornings lately, which I've, I enjoy it. Yeah. Um, we did want to do it today. Um, because we didn't want to be behind on a week. We want to make sure we have an episode always. Um, we also can't do it this Saturday, so. Yeah. Justin's got his birthday thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's so selfish, dude. <laughs> I'm actually excited for that. Yeah, it should be fun. Because I can actually go because it's like during the day kind of thing. Because I have to work at midnight, so I, you know. Dallas just found out that the beer garden has like mules that are like this fucking big. What? Yes. I'm calling it work. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, uh, we're doing that. That's that. going to be a thing. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's cool. They, it comes in a giant fucking the copper mugs, too. But they have to be playing that really cheesy, like Disney accordion music. The, the polka? I mean, yeah. oh, that's what that's called. Sorry. German culture? <laughs> yes, <I don't> <laughs> yeah. It's, it's a beer garden, dude. I don't know. You insensitive fuck, dude. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't think, I don't think that you can be racist towards Germans. I don't know if that's a thing. No, it's not. <laughs> yeah. I'm German. Yeah, we know. Ah. Huh. Um, with a K, Kraut. <laughs> That's how you spell Kraut. Um, yeah. This next band is called. <laughs> <laughs> this band is called Nut, and the song is called <laughs> Force to Obey. <laughs> It's amazing how well the, the cover goes with the song. <laughs> so ignorant, fun, It's just like the kids are just show up and they're gonna fuck it up. Yeah, they're late. That's cool. Get a chain with a padlock on it. Good bass Somebody... note. It's heavy. Yeah, it's heavy as fuck. Yeah, it's pissed. I do enjoy when bands like this actually do have really good quality recordings. Yeah. Because typically you could drop a in a barrel and find like a million bands. And you know it's usually budget. That's okay. Yeah, sure. But when they take the time, it's like, ah, yeah. It's now you're right. You're you're completely right. Because yeah. a lot of times it's just easier just to plug and play and program all that stuff. I don't know how hard it is to like have a it, dude. The technology is weird. It's wild. I don't understand it anymore. Like it used to be, you have to have an amp. Then you have to have an ISO box with a mic. You have to have the mic <laughs> go into an interface. Do all this shit. Now it's like I just plug in your computer. Windows comes with a fucking uh, distortion. I'm surprised. Preset. I'm surprised the guitars just don't have just USB ports instead of like they do. Uh, okay, cool. They fucking do. <laughs> they, like, dude. Well, I was talking earlier about the Helix. It's like you literally plug that into a power amp that goes yeah. into the thing, and you have a whole. It's just it's fucking wild. Yeah. And it's like I, I, I can see the convenience of it, and it's awesome. But I'm like, I don't know. Maybe I'm just stuck in my ways. <laughs> I, I'm, just, I'm being honest. Like, I was like, no, I want that amp behind me. You're so uh, analog, dude. <sighs> <laughs> but you know what's not? It's like it's not cheaper. <laughs> it's just no, lighter. It's just it is, lighter. It's, That's all it is. It's just less stuff. You know what? And back to what we were saying about like inconveniences with technology. Yeah. You, you know what the the last thing I want to deal with is when I turn on my amp? <laughs> Firmware update. <Yeah. laughs> fuck. Ah, fuck. Dude, I was editing the other night and it was like I just I rendered a clip and I put it back into the timeline and it's like there's no there's no movie here. No, that's how quick it is. Mm -mm. There's like, mm -mm. there's no, there's no, no, that's not a movie. I don't know what you're trying to show me. So then I went to uh, file, check for updates. <laughs> 18.6 is out. Downloaded it. Oh, there's the movie you put in there. Like, you just, <laughs> it's very annoying. <laughs> yeah. I will, uh, you, you've been crushing the clubs, dude. All the media, you've been crushing. Well, not according to TikTok. TikTok can suck a dick. I hope it gets canceled by how badly they've been treating us. Like <laughs> I, I don't get it. No, I was. I remember you were you you came over after you know the gas station thing and you were you, yeah, fit, sure, you, yeah. you had to remove my garbage disposal and uh, yeah. I remember talking to you. It was like, dude, all the videos on TikTok telling you how to avoid the quote unquote unoriginal content 
is a whole video of them committing copyright infringement. Yeah. Like, here's a video I downloaded from ESPN. <laughs> it's like, how? Wait, what? Why? I don't know. Yeah. It's like it, TikTok's like use use our filter. Like, I don't want the fucking. Who cares? The only thing I can get from it is somewhat of a compliment. Is that our stuff looks so good, thanks to you, that it doesn't look like it could be made by us that we're stealing it from somebody else. And that's, and that's not how original. Much, that's how much faith <laughs> TikTok has in most of you. <laughs> no, I'm just so like, now we're like, it, we're like crutched to like a hundred plays of video. Like get it is fucked. wild. It and it's not like we were getting like, no, but we were getting more than that. No, no, no. You're and right. We, no, no, we've you're been right. steady posting. And uh, I even, I did what you did. I changed up the, the hashtags and I, stuff I like don't that. Know, I don't know if that I, was affecting like, it or not, but you said you had one problem with the ritual killer thing. I was like, because they cool. has the word killer in it. Yeah. yeah, yeah Which yeah. I get, I get that. Yeah. That's fine. Or whatever. But, um, That's stupid. Blowing yeah. up on Instagram though. You guys are. China kills people it's, it's, all the time. It's, it's, it's blowing up on Instagram. <laughs> it's blowing up on Instagram because like we're tagging the bands. Mm -hmm. So like we're getting the help from the bands. That makes sense. Yeah. But like all of our, like, uh, our dialogue, clips on tiktok are doing pretty decent i will be i will be well and i was I, yeah that's actually a good point i was talking to justin about that it's like all of our dialogue talking points that we you know we we have in, in some episodes but it's like mostly just bullshit banter and then the music you know and that's what you know we right. talk about but i i don't get it because I, I do kind of understand because there's a lot of bands that we've played i mean we played almost six over 600 bands i know it's crazy there's only like three of them that i see on tiktok I I don't see a lot on, of bands on TikTok. On that TikTok, on the the band or the the bands the the podcast TikTok, I do see a lot of the same bands. Yeah, um, some some that we have done, you know, yeah, like. Yeah, but sure. I also follow like Florida hardcore. Oh no, yeah, like absolutely. That, so. But I think, but it's funny because I think because <clears throat> I've I've bitched on multiple episodes on how hard it is to even find some of these bands. Like, just in general. Dude commented on a TikTok today. He's like, just, I can't even find this on YouTube. Where'd you guys find this? Yeah. Well, we had that one is band. It's that, that band. It's the same yeah, band. Yeah, it was Give, to, give, give to Today. Yeah, Give Today. And they're like, how the fuck did you find us? It's like, dude, you were on Bandcamp. <laughs> we, we're trying to gatekeep ourselves, dude. Like, how'd you no, find us? <laughs> but it makes sense because we, I think we touched on this a little bit. But they don't, I don't think they have Spotify like we have Spotify. I don't know. I don't know how it is. But the thing is, is. I was like, okay, so I can't find half these bands ever. But then when, I'm when I think TikTok bands, I don't think of bands that we play. I don't think of Bandcamp bands. No, no, no. I don't think of any of the bands that we play. I, because, I yeah. mean, I, I would, um, I would automatically associate it with. Because no. where was Give Today from? Uh, Sweden. Sweden. Yeah. Um, which they fuck. They, they're super good. But um, I love the language barrier because he was, he was. I could, you could I, tell. I yeah, knew yeah, he yeah. was happy, but he was just like, oh, cool. Thanks. Yeah. It like, <laughs> but it was like, I know he was appreciative. Yeah, you know, but I know there's a language barrier. But it's like, how did you find us? Mm. Oh, my my biggest thing that like always makes me happy is when another band shares us and they use their like their language like, oh, in, the, yeah, in, the, yeah. in the in the in the videos it or whatever. A lot. I'm yeah. like, this is sick. <laughs> now, one of my bands today is from Belgium. Mm. Yeah. And I'm just like, fuck, I don't even know what language they speak. Belgian knees did mean very good. <laughs> Waffle. <laughs> uh, no, yeah, that's cool. But, but it is it is wild. But you know, one thing to touch on touch on that is uh, kind of cool. One uh, one of my bands I want to play today is from Denver. And my first thought Ooh. was, and this is why I think it's cool that we've done so many bands. Uh, so our buddy Chris, that's in playing for keeps, they're from Denver, and I'm like, there's no way he hasn't heard of this band or hasn't played with them. Yeah, I'm like, that's kind of cool. Yeah, you know, I don't know a lot of the times like we'll play one band. Uh, That's right, they are from Denver. Yeah, so I'm like, you know, I'm trying to get better at that. their shows. Look like fun, dude. I've been watching yeah, like when know. they do play. Let's go to Denver. Uh, I've it's been gorgeous in, there. I've been there once. It's so pretty. I went to a hotel convention center. It was pretty cool. Sounds sick. Yeah, sounds sick. I looked at sounds a weed, sick. Dude. I looked at a weed store and I was like, nah, I don't know. That sounds. You're no Sabaro <laughs> Mall Court Pizza. Uh, yeah. But, you know. <laughs> Get your Pantagonias over there to Denver's. <laughs> you know what the funniest thing? Okay, so you brought up Patagonia. Going, <laughs> going to... Okay, so I used to work for Quicksilver in New York City. Okay. You know what the wildest thing to sell in a Quicksilver in New York City in the middle of the Greenwich Villages? Uh, surfboards. <laughs> <laughs> like, so in Patagonia, there was a, a Patagonia store, obviously. It's like, you're selling rock climbing gear... In New York City, it's like, I mean, I get it. People travel, but I'm just, yeah. Like, 
But like, it's some, a fashion statement. For is somebody going to bring all this fucking rock climbing gear and rigging and all this shit and, <laughs> and go buy a surfboard? Just, oh, it's in my apartment. No big deal. Like, I get all my rock climbing gear in New York. Yeah, I get that. No big I got to I got to hook up over there. I fly over there and get uh, my my uh, my my ropes. I go surf to Lady Liberty. No get my deal. C clips and um, <laughs> yeah, just. Uh, Mm. New York has the best chalk. I swear to God. I go over to New York and I get the best climbing chalk. My little chalk bag. <laughs> the best. It's the best. It comes from China. <laughs> TikTok. <laughs> you know what's funny is, uh, you know how they, there's a lot of a lot of places, uh, like local governments all over the country, like banning TikTok. Mm-hmm. Like, the city don't care. <laughs> yeah. like, wow. This is Florida, motherfucker. <clears throat> yeah, Florida does have a... Yeah, Florida is kind of its own thing. <laughs> Tune into our politic talk, uh, <laughs> or don't. Yeah, I have to put a ski mask on for that. <laughs> and while <you're... laughs> and I wear a big hoodie. <laughs> oh. oh yeah, we're not. We're not going. Hey, we've been doing this for about two years now. Just want to let you know, dude. It is wild because I'll see it come up and it's like congratulations. A year and a half, episode eighteen. I'm like, oh my god. So, boys, um, popped up yesterday. I think on my memories is when we found that TV across the street from your old house. And we try oh, to yeah. plug it in, and then you drop the stone on it. That's yeah. like that's like early, like that's like early days. Do you still have that video? I have it. Yeah. Okay, send it to me. I'll so I can put it in post. <laughs> but then we put a sign on that said "works." <laughs> yeah. Dude, it's like a giant gaping hole in it. It's hilarious. Yeah. I don't. Yeah. Ha- I might have that photo. Yeah. It's fucking oh, so funny. Shit. Yeah. It, it's been wild. I still can't believe it's been that long. But um. <clears throat> I, uh, I, I'm having fun with it. I enjoy it. Yeah. You know, one thing I wanted to bring up, I'll play before I play my next song. Um, I didn't have any. So when we started this podcast, I, I didn't have any band shirts anymore. Like, I, I mean, I had them when I was, you know, I grew out of them. You know, I got fat and big and a trap grew three sizes that day. The Grinch. Um, so, but now since we've had the, and we've gone, gone to shows, you know, I've been going to shows again, dude. I, I want, I'm going to do it after this when you guys leave. I'm going to take a, I'm going to fold them all up. And yeah. th- dude, I have so fucking yeah. many shirts, dude. You're welcome, bud. Dude, it's insane. You're welcome. And I'm just like, I, and then I forget that like, you know, some of our awesome, you know, uh, bands that we played, you know, they send us stuff. Yeah. And it's like, and I forget like, oh, Jada sent me two. Jada does. Yeah. Like, God damn, bro. Jada has sent us two. God damn. We- Each. Yeah, I know. Each. <laughs> God damn. Yeah, they, they must got it made different up there in Jersey, dude. <laughs> yeah, the tax is higher. The fucking it's something in the frogs, dude. Something's up with the frogs. Making the frogs gay! <laughs> in the water. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. While you're at Lamb Goat. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's actually the best segue we've ever done. He died of a Yeah, yeah. Use the code HMHD <laughs> at lambgo.com to get no ads, dark mode, and common mm. embeds. Uh, you get with the code HMHD 20% off, which is $4 a month of $40 for the entire year for life. Use the code HMHD. Thank you so much. It's worth it. Lamb Goat. Did you post the dark mode clip yet? <laughs> <laughs> no. It's pretty funny. I liked it. Um, tomorrow, I'll post it tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, I, I, I'm, I'm happy about it. I'm glad. Yeah. Use our code. Uh, yeah. Anyway, I'm sorry. I've been awake for so long. I'm so fucking out of it. He's going on 68 hours. It's crazy. It's actually it's almost 69. Nice. Uh, it's, <laughs> it's actually been almost <laughs> so choice. It's actually 20, 26 hours. 26 hours. Um. So I'm trying to. I told you to take a nap today. When, when can I nap, RJ? Nap? What do you, you got off at noon. Yeah. Four hour nap. I had to go to the salon and build stuff. You say, no, I need a nap. I can't do that. I'll Never te- say no. I'll teach you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Anyway, you know what? Since we're on the topic, just play this this band. I found this band the other day, and man, they're fucking wild. And I like it the most because it's like been kind of out of the realm of the last couple of episodes. Um so the band's called Ignorant Bliss, and the song's called uh, Time to Die. We haven't played this yet? No. No. No, we played Pure Bliss. Pure Bliss. Which they're playing in Daytona soon, too. I wish I, I'm going to try to go to that show. Yeah. I love that band. Oh, yeah. Um, okay. Ignorant. So this band's from Denver, and that's why we talk about, I am wonder if, you know, playing for keeps has played with them or not. But, man, this, this band is, like, wild. And it's just fucking sick. It's heavy. It's cool it's, graphic, dude. Oh, yeah. That's my, that's what's going on in my brain right now. Right. 
Kind of sounds like Mean Pete a little bit. <laughs> I don't know. It does a little bit. A little bit. They say time waits for no one. A little bit. Good. How dare you say so? What did I? Why grab my life for others? Dude, it just goes everywhere. This is wild. <laughs> it like doesn't want to give it to you. It's so close. The Reaper's calling out my name. Is it finally my time to die? Oh, hoo -hoo. Woo! It's, it, it's awesome. It's... <clears throat> And we haven't even gotten there yet. <laughs> what? Yeah, we haven't gotten there yet. <laughs> That's how awesome. It kind of reminds me a little bit of the last 10 seconds of life. Yeah, yeah I get that too. His voice is so good. So good. So good. <laughs> Sometimes I feel you with me. What? Sometimes I feel nothing at all. What was ever going on? What a seamless transition to a fucking dude. That was so oh, fucking seamless as fuck, dude. dude. You brought back a previous rip and you brought it back. Oh. So smooth. I got goosebumps, dude. Woo! Dude. Dude, I, I was driving my truck off this. I was cool, so. Pedestrian life don't matter. <laughs> Ignorant. And that's, Blitz, that's out of my realm, fuck. dude. That's like not typically in my realm. Oh. I thought I turned it on playoff. I, oh, was that the same I, song? Is this a new was, band? That was me. This, I don't know how new the band is. This album came out like literally a few days ago. Jesus. Five days ago. <laughs> that was really cool. Yeah, I got like a kind of like a last 10 seconds of life only because like it is heavy and it has that same kind of speed. Like it's dark and like just fucking heavy, but it has its moments where it speeds up slows down or whatever but like his voice commanded it's like i don't it, know so cool it, so dark well what i liked about it is the chuggy parts weren't just straight chords they try to add a little bit of substance into yeah. it yeah and i don't know what it is and that's not typically my realm no no it's not it's a little slow for me but right, yeah man, but it's just the combination of all of it it's so good you guys you guys are good you guys rule yeah, that 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 was sick, dude. And your name actually describes exactly what we just heard. Just ignorant fucking bliss, bro. Ignant, dude. That's it. Ignant. <laughs> Ain't it? Yeah. Kill my boy Biggie. <laughs> <laughs> my next band has <laughs> members of Grieving Room in it. Oh. <laughs> what are you doing here? What do we got? This band is called Shades of War. Oh, I, okay. I did yes, see sir. this. I haven't listened to it, but I, I did. I remember seeing that. Yeah, yeah. The song is called "Your End." And then, so this band's local too, Jacksonville, or I mean, I'm assuming been. Florida. Yeah. Oh yeah, we know. Warsaw, this. Poland. This is good. Oh, it's Cap. It's featuring Mouth for War. Yeah. They're on everything. Holy shit, dude! Mouth for War. Goddamn. <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo.
They went old school on it. I like it. I like it. I love it when bands find just a little. That's why I love riffs. I mean, that's weird. Do metal people like riffs? That's crazy. Um, did you find a little bit of a way just to make it? Just a uh, shades of orf. What they probably play with Jay. Yeah. Anyway. Uh, yeah. There's. I don't know. For Jacksonville, dude, that fucking rules. I love like dude. <laughs> even so, we talked about like the like, thrashier kind of stuff uh, and the recording stuff. His voice, like they went deep into the thrash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, his voice is good. He's got a killer voice. Yeah, I don't know which members are which I'm from gonna... Grieving Room, but I don't know. Yeah, the good ones. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. The Grieving Room was one of those, like, get back, when you, get when, back together. Yeah, yeah. I don't think it's going to And then play with your other band. That's cool. <laughs> yeah, play, yeah, do that. Speaking of Jacksonville bands, Return to Pain, uh, I'm so excited for that. I can't believe they're opening that show. I was like, because I hadn't seen the flyer. And I was like, fuck. And then I was like, return to pain. I was like, oh, what? what time are the doors? Seven. Seven. So yeah. like 930. No. <laughs> no. I don't know. I've never no. been to Tiramisu, so I don't know. Jesus. <laughs> Me either, Drew. It's going to be. It's gonna also, be... Tiramisu is kind of gross, right? Like the, the uh, dessert. I, I ate a bowl of it last week. Dude. <laughs> really? <All right. laughs> A ball of I it, used dude. to make yeah. it. I used to make it. I don't know. Dude, lady fingers. I don't call it a lady. An fingers. espresso. That's what they are. I know it's gross. What the fuck? Besides calling it what they are, the word finger is gross. <laughs> really? Yeah. Is it like moist for you? Like no, you know how, no, no. I'm not saying you know like moist bothers. That made me uncomfortable. Like, Just like don't say that word. So yeah. fingers is your like. Well, it's like okay. So uh, Autumn used to watch Coco Melon. Okay, when okay. she when she was little little. And one of the songs was called Daddy Finger. Where are you? Yeah. I'm like, that, yeah. don't, don't, don't. Uh, I, That's weird. <laughs> it's fucking Coco Melon, get it together. It makes you feel sexually confused. No, it makes me <laughs> like, don't say that in public. It's gross. You're it makes be, you feel weird, right? You get on a fucking list and you're not going to be allowed to coach T ball anymore. <laughs> it makes you feel weird, right? <laughs> I don't know. I didn't play T ball. <laughs> <laughs> I did. <laughs> oh. Hey, night episodes. Gnarly. <laughs> mm. uh, that band fucking ruled, dude. Yeah. Yep. Yes, it did. So that band's current. Like, are they they're playing shows? Yeah, I, or... think, I think that was actually a newer song. Oh, okay. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think it came out end of last year. Am I right on that? Yeah, you're right. He sounds so quiet. Yes. 
No, no, you're you're right. No, I'm already mad at you guys I'm because I, I, looking at the list right here, and also I can see oh, I can see Drew's playlist. You guys have taken so many bands for me today. Looking at you through the we need to, so we need, many bands. We need to get today. Justin the Sham Wow guy your, like, headset. You're literally three, <laughs> oh my god, you're, you're, <laughs> the TED Talk headset. <laughs> you're three for four from bands on my list. Are you serious? Already. Yes, I'm dead serious. And yeah. and five and six on on what I see what you have up there. Six bands today. Hey, that has to be off my list just, because of what you guys are doing. Today. Just do better. No, it's no. I already had them on my list. What do you mean, do better? Do better though. You guys get like five plays a person, and you finally are found my list. Make your own podcast, Dave. I finally. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being so mean to Justin tonight. No way. <laughs> no way. Because <laughs> his birthday's coming up. That's a lot of nuts. <laughs> That's yeah. nothing fun. That's one of my new uh, sound clips. <laughs> I, I like that. Mm. Kung Pao. I did go heavy into Kung Pao. Um, <laughs> I did. Anyway. Um, it's good. So you need a pound of. Uh, what do you think? So you just played one. You know, so, play one and take a break. Yeah, yeah. Um, shit, I don't know which one I want to play. Which one? Which one did I steal? Just <laughs> uh, either Pandora or oh, uh, Lock good... Slip. Yeah, they're both they're both good. Do Pandora. Okay, I'm not gonna play those. <laughs> uh, play. Uh, this is the song I picked for you, Justin. And Aww. the and, and the ending of the song, uh, I was. It's a two song EP, but I was like kind of skimming through it to figure it out, and then I heard a sound clip, and I'm like, <laughs> I'm not not playing that. Uh, so uh, play Exit. You thought. This band's from like New Jersey, PA. They have, that's what it says on their profile. But uh, it's it's a little again out of my realm. But I thought Justin would like it. So Chris. Now does he have the pauses? Undaunted, I knew no. the game was mine to win. Just like in life, all of my successes depend on me. I'm the man oh, who has thought it was a rap in the I'm beginning. the man who can throw it fast. It is. Than fuck. It so that is why <laughs> I am better than everyone in the world. Kiss my ass and suck my dick. <laughs> everyone. <laughs> That's not even the sound clip. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I can't even head into this. What you got to trust me? What it is now? We all know you're nothing what you talk about. Don't try to talk your shit about me. I got to say, you get just... what the great perfect you are just me. Don't even try to come Damn, out. Damn, I can't even say what's up. Because we all say who you want. But you just be <laughs> one of us. I did enjoy it the most because they, they brought the beat down, the beat down, and they kept the speed up, and it was still like, God damn, I, I love that shit. Obviously, I love riffs like this. Oh my god, it's voice is so great. It's over. I'm trying to figure out what. I did try to do the same thing. Anything popping up in your head, Rock? What? That they remind you of? What's up, brother? Stop screaming, you spotless! Be so hot, you got this, you know! Fuck where you go! Fuck everyone you got with you! You got to go! Desert to get by your best! My ass are best! No, no! Yeah, 
Yeah, nothing was, popped up. That was, that was that's what I heard. Was like, that was fuck different, you now. dude. That was different. That was awesome. Who was that again? Exit. Exit. Yeah. Uh, their exit fifty three on their uh, Instagram, which I'm sure is an exit off ninety five. Maybe I'm probably wrong, but um, they're from New Jersey. I was gonna say fifty three would be north, right? That would be like way up there. I, I don't know, but but they're from New Jersey and Pennsylvania, so I imagine they'd have to take ninety five to get there. We would have to ask Wayne. Yeah, Wayne knows those roads. Yeah. <laughs> Wayne knows roads. 95 sucks, bro. <laughs> um, no, one thing I like about that band is it kind of, because it went so well with like the slower to the fast, it kind of, one of my favorite bands, Red Chord, it kind of gave me a little bit of that. His voice was pretty like, I don't know. It's that, aggressive. The voice is different. No, it's it, different. It, it's it's like it, scratching yeah. my head because it, it's, it's different. Like, <sighs> it reminds me of something, but it's unique in its own realm. So like, it's, it's not like a, copy of anything by any means but like is it scratching your head on anything Justin? i think that's the no i think that's the point <clears throat> what you just said is like perfect because like dude his vocals like it almost doesn't fit because it's it's almost doesn't so yeah so fucking visceral but at the same time they're playing those like typical like metal riffs in there but they're also heavy as shit and they're just like having fun and it's like this doesn't like I yeah, love, i love that they kept bringing back this in the best the way speed possible with it though that, yeah that's what kind of like the speed is me. cool well, yeah, speed's always because you, you almost had like a beat down esque music with yeah. some riffs, right? Yeah, yeah. But you, then you had almost kind of like with that band you played earlier vocals. That's kind of like a last ten seconds, like this very kind of yeah. like metal, like just dark fucking yeah. vocals. Uh, it's very cool. But they were abrasive, but it wasn't oh, yeah. weird enough to where it didn't fit. Like it was very cohesive. Like like what you were saying. Yeah, it's like very. Like, it, it, the it, yeah, it was a. A riff heavy band, but it wasn't flashy and it wasn't but the beat down part was right, right. But that's wild. what I'm saying. It's like in the studio they could have probably done so many other things and sure. all this shit and reverbs and fucking synths and whatever. But they didn't. And yeah. like, that's why I liked it. I was like, this fucking push record, let's go. Here it is. Be a band. Tits. Um be a band, bro. Tattoos are dumb. <laughs> Tattoos are dumb, dude. <laughs> Some ideas for sure. <laughs> <laughs> TikTok. Uh, all right, you want to take a break, break? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> oh. <Yeah>. <laughs> We're back. <laughs> what the fuck's up? Oh, what's up? <sighs> I just shed my brains out. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> well, it's a good toilet. <laughs> it was so funny because I was like, no, oh, no, I gotta go. And I just <laughs> like no. barreled my way through there. <laughs> like, that, was, that happens to me. I think I was telling you yesterday. So, like, at work, we have two gates and, like, we have. Two different administration buildings, and like there's like a secret bathroom that nobody uses that I love because my feet can touch the ground. Uh, <laughs> the other one, I had like my feet dangle, <laughs> so I'm like I don't want to use that one because I feel like a child and I can't get enough leverage. So I'm like, yeah, fuck that. <laughs> but there's been many times where I've gone in the wrong gate on purpose, like oh, I can't do it. I sprint. I don't even turn off the car. <laughs> like, yeah. Slam it in park. Yeah. <laughs> you, know, you gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta do what you gotta do. Hey. I shat in many a buckets because of that. So, oh, yeah. bucket shits. Yeah. Speaking of the Midwest, there's a cornfield with my shit in it. <laughs> Someone ate my corn. <laughs> hmm. Ah. Another Florida band. No, right? Wait, whose turn is it? My turn? It's my turn. Is it your turn? Yeah. Oh, you played that cool band. Oh yeah. Um, this band's called Izora. I Z O R A. Oh, yeah, I've seen I've seen them uh commenting a lot on stuff. Um and the song is called Bruxa. What? B R U X A. Yeah. <laughs> Did I spell it right? Did I say it right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's just a weird word. Yeah. Are they making macaroni and cheese? Oh god. Put it back. <laughs> Cut his head off. Yeah, cut it. Yeah, yeah, kill him. <laughs> Bitch. Oh, fuck. Vocal <laughs> Dude, isn't this fucking sick, dude? 
to play a venue once and they're like nah never again you can't come here. yeah so we're not allowed in these <laughs> counties anymore um yeah well I'm kind if of i'm saying your name wrong i'm very sorry isora zora uh i don't know put them with psycho frame let's do it yeah, that's actually a good combo yeah uh, yeah yeah is, is zora the explorer dude i don't know something swipe about no swipe it's been a vocal episode dude these vocals have been it, it's, it's been a yeah we don't normally cover this much kind of that that realm yeah which is good yeah, this is cool. Change is good. Yeah. So that that's so they're from Tampa. Yeah. Play over here, the Abra. <sighs> Bro. Yeah, yeah, come over. There's, I mean, hold on. Let us put the plywood up first. <laughs> you would almost have to. Dude, that would that yeah that shit was pissed. No, it was good. Yeah. Yeah. It was blurry, but it was a Jackson. I saw it. I saw it too. I saw a Jackson. I saw a Jackson. Oh God. Okay. Well, I'm. I guess I'll play one of my other bands that I took from Justin. Do it. Uh, go ahead and play Lockslip. Yeah. They're from LA. And I, I heard of this band. I found this band a couple months ago on a, one of the websites we got to go to. And I was like, damn, this is good. And I just, I was like, well, I was on a kick of not playing like just the hardcore stuff. I was like, ah, fuck it. Let's do it. <laughs> and, uh, man, it's good. It's, it's a wild ride. Lockslip, evil doer. Evil doer. <laughs> Like letting you in. Like, hey, come, come listen to us. <laughs> I lost the pressure. This the This is cool. It, 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 it. No, I like this. It's Why are you so afraid? Show me the truth. There are guns that just like you. Pretending you they fail. My energy is just like that. Layer to the other rip on that. How many layers? Why are you so afraid? How did you do 
going from point A to point B right now. <laughs> That's the coolest part about it. Mm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, they can't see what I'm pointing at. <laughs> Scarlet? Yeah, it's Scarlet This is wild. I want to see this. I love bands that make you, like, you don't know where it's going. Like, you don't know. I thought they were going to fool me, but they didn't. Woo. It's just, it's all over the place, but it's in one place at the same time. Whew, lock slip. <clears throat> From the beginning to the end, I don't know how I got there. <laughs> California. Well, that's a one-way flight, but I mean, the, the music was <laughs> more complicated than that. No, that's fucking wild, dude. <laughs> it's just, it, it, it gave, obviously gave me Scarlet. I love Scarlet. Yeah. And that, you know, like that spontaneity of the, in, um, just, you're right. They teased you with it. They teased you with the parts and they tried to, um, I don't know. It's shit. like they give you whiplash because you're like, oh, okay, and you're like, oh wait, hold on. I know. I uh, rock, I rock my headphones off three times. <laughs> rock them off, rock them off hard. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that shit was rad. Um, this next band is called Allegiance, and the song is called "Wake Me When It's Over." <laughs> I don't know if they're from Florida, but I'm getting a huge Florida, right? <laughs> Kids like us fucking Red Baron. Little comeback here. Oh, for sure. Northern Cali. Oh, the pig slide. Fuck! Forgot about the pig slide. Oh my god! How is this not a Florida sound? <laughs> I don't know, they're in Cali. They can play with Johnny Bro. <laughs> True. Oh, I like that. Oh my gosh. I like that. Northern Cali's the new South Florida. No, it's not. Mm, yeah. It's lower, not. Lower, tax, <laughs> lower taxes. Yeah. Uh, that's fucking oh, I love that. So that when I when I found that I was like instantly like rock hard because it just reminded me of just like my middle school like skateboarding just fucking just like you would listen to like I would listen to something like that and be like okay and try to pick up my guitar before ta like before I like found out what tabs were I'm like I'm gonna try to play I'm gonna try to figure out how to play this because it was like kind of almost punky right obviously there's like there's roots to yeah, it it's fast yeah but sure. like that southern. Okay, I, I know it's not Southern Florida, but like to me, it ha it reminds me of, of that it Southern does. Florida two step chord. It's just fun, like you said, like kids like us, you know that kind of stuff. It's just mm -hmm. you're a little like, guns up like that. Well, I got no, like, no, hey, no, no, no. his vocals kind of remind me of Red Baron a little bit. Uh, not Red Baron, I'm sorry. Um, uh, Barriers, not bridges. Okay, uh, Red Baron was Mean Pete, but uh, right. But I, I kind of associated that kind of tone with that, but then it immediately made me think of Donnie Brook. Yeah, but obviously his voice is not no. the same tone. But it's, like, it's in the same like realm. Just short, quick, know. sweet to the point. But as like, ah. that's how I like my like my hardcore music. You know, like mm -hmm. I, I like just short ah, punch. Next punch. You, you play like twelve songs on a set. You know, like <laughs> so. yeah. Your set's twenty minutes. We we need fifteen. Yeah, <laughs> we're gonna play our entire discography, <laughs> dude. Guess how long a uh, spite set is over Europe? I don't know. Just take a guess. An hour? 55 minutes. Damn. Yeah. Well, that makes sense. They're headlining, right? I think they're doing 45 and then two encore songs. Okay. Well, that makes sense. Or potential. I mean, when you're on a bill, when you're on a bill like that, like you're that's a long time. 
An hour is a long time, dude. <laughs> yeah, it's funny. They had a lot of music, though. <laughs> no, it's true. I remember so many times. And they I... aren't playing the offering. Oh, shit. It's like, really? They're not. It's like one of my favorite songs. Why I, uh, not? I don't know. Well, it wasn't offered to you. Hmm. Um, I remember so many times where I, we, when when I Am Divide was playing, they were like, oh, we're going to give you guys 40 minutes. Like, we don't have enough songs. <laughs> That's a long time, dude. 40 minutes is a long time. Dude, 25. Holy shit. Like, for a local band, like, 15, 20, 25 minutes, like, that's a good, like, like I'm going to talk to the crowd. Everyone needs a tune-up between every song. <laughs> like, it's a long it. time. I hate it. Oh, God. I feel like if we didn't, like, when we were in our missus, Justin, like, if we didn't have a song, be like, we would just improv. You know, we could just do that. Oh, yeah, dude, For 10 I mean, minutes. We, we even, like, covered mailing just to, like, Fill the void. Back in the day, before that, that makes we, sense. Though. When we were like a band between bands, so like while the bands are tearing down and setting back up, we were on the stage, like stage left of it, mm -hmm. and we would play. Oh. Yeah, we were just a house band, and um, we most of the, we we had a few songs, but we would improv. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and uh, I mean it's to. it's southern hardcore. It's super simple. Yeah, um, but it was so much fun. I, I remember one time we did a mailing cover. Not your typical. Everyone did caution. Everyone did caution or whatever. We, we did, did the gate. I think is what we did. We did the gate, and uh, I remember we played it. And then, uh, like three bands later, we were about to play again, and enough people heard about our cover from earlier that oh, we yeah. they requested us to play it again. <laughs> <laughs> we made thirty five dollars. Dude, that, that place night. was packed. That was the oh, most. That's the most people I've seen in Church of the Rock. And it was Dude, to put that into a four hundred one k. I know. Right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Getting residuals. We, dude. Yeah, dude. We, yeah, right? Dude, we got an envelope. I'm like, why are we getting money? Why are we getting sued? <laughs> you right have an envelope right now? <laughs> they gave us an envelope of money. I was like, what? And it was 35 bucks. And there's only three of us in the band. Yeah. We didn't even have a bass player. <laughs> no, we didn't need one. We didn't need one. No, we barely had a drummer. Barely. Dude, <laughs> dude I'm sorry. We went to a show without a drummer. So. Yeah. Dude. We had merch, but no drummer. <laughs> He was wearing the I forgot about that, dude. And the lights were on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> dude, I'm forgetting and the only people in the crowd was the other bands. <laughs> Talk about repressed memories. Dude. Yeah, You're no. opening oh, bubbles. They're, they're right at my cerebral. Yeah. They're right here, Jesus dude. Christ. They're right in my frontal cortex, dude. It was a lot of fun. I miss, pl I miss <laughs> that playing. Was, that was fun, is it? It was fun. When you, when you don't have, yeah, it was fun. Yeah. I, I remember um, <laughs> when uh, we used to play I love you. Seabreeze Metal Lounge all the time. So we'd be like the last band there or whatever, and nobody would be hanging out. But uh, so at band practice, we always used to get bored. I'm like, well, I want to do vocals. <laughs> and then, you know, somebody else, but they all played guitar. And then, you know, we just do like some tough guy, like bullshit. We used to call it X Die X. I love it. It's like a joke, you know. And yeah. I, I remember I did vocals for it. And we did it one time at the CBS Metal Lounge, and everybody was like, it's a different band? <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, dude. Just, what the fuck? Just goobin. Yeah, that. <laughs> That band when we were doing the church stuff or like whatever, it was uh Muscle for Muscle for Hire yeah. was the name of our man. Mm -hmm. X M F H F X. Yeah. And I bought a bunch of like cheap we went to the dollar store and got this cheap like hats, remember? Oh yeah. My dad had a little um like spray gun, like and I would make oh, little airbrush. Thing? Airbrush, yeah. yeah, yeah. And um we'd make little stencils and yeah. <laughs> it was it was fun. Like we had a good time. Like Five dollars a shirt, two dollars a hat, just like yeah, fuck it. So. Yeah, whatever. I remember the MF MF MFH and then you had like the seagull, you made a little stencil. I had an there. eagle and I like put it over here and it yeah. said muscle for hire. You know, yeah. just that's what everyone was the doing back then. The white V neck. The white V neck. And the bleach. The yeah. bleach. I did, we we yeah. did we did the bleach ones for our mistas. A lot of people yeah. do bleach. Which, yeah. Yeah, it was good. It was a cheap way to do it. It was super cheap. Cool. And what I liked about the bleach one is that everyone is a little bit different. Like, no matter how well you try to do oh, it, no, 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 they're no. all just a little bit different. There was a... there was a One of the ones we, like... <laughs> so, it was A-R-M, uh, I-S-T-I-C-E, and, like, the I-C-E was in the middle, so it says arm ice iced ist or whatever. So, it was, oh, like, yeah. it was all, like, mixed up. <laughs> and I was like, fuck, we did a wrong one. Sold them to ISIS, yeah. Yeah. We, um, yeah. <laughs> Toyota. Um, I remember there was a, <laughs> I don't know. I remember there was a, there was a brand back in the day called Rocket with two T's. I this think. was a clothing brand? It was a clothing brand. I'm, I'm sure somebody from some band back in the day was in charge of it. Um, but it's gonna, all the old guys that listen to the show, I'm like, oh, fuck, I remember that brand. Uh, it was Rocket with two T's. It was kind of like Johnny Cupcakes, but it was like, okay. it was Rocket. 
no, whatever. Yeah. Um, but that's the first time I remember people using bleach. Okay. Like he would do like the custom, not custom. I mean, you you can't you know, customize a spray bottle. Come on, give me a fucking break. <laughs> but um, but yeah, the, obviously, like you said, you're never gonna get it the same. So they right. would do that, and uh, yeah, I remember that. I did that for um, ambitionist for our logo. Like I made a, I got a black bed sheet from a uh, Walmart, mm. and then I printed out and I made, a, <laughs> I had a picture of our logo, and then I made it into like fifteen, uh, eleven by seventeen sheets, and I printed it. And I cut it out, and then I just sprayed it with bleach, and it actually came out really good. Kyle, actually, ask him if he has it still, because <laughs> I, I feel like that'd be cool in here. Yeah, you know, on the ceiling or right. something. Yeah, it would help with the echo. I remember for, for me, the, the first time I saw it, and it was really cool to me. Was like, "Behold the man," had behold. I have a "Behold yeah, the yeah. man" shirt, and yeah. uh, the sacred did one too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember "Behold the man." Yeah, yeah. "Behold man," "Behold the man." Was Who was in rad, that, dude? Uh, Denny. Um, the drummer, dude. Drummer, um, I, I think it was Logan was in there. Um, uh, okay, think, yeah, I yeah, think Logan played guitar. That, yeah, that's me. And was Behold the Man the vocalist? Was it? Was it Daniel? Did Daniel do vocals for that? I don't know. Yeah, wasn't, I don't it, know. wasn't it somebody that was in Oceana? Uh, that was Denny. Denny, okay, yeah. Denny was in Oceana. Yeah. Or Danny, Denny, Denny. Denny. It was yeah. Denny. Yeah, yeah. Denny right. played guitar for Behold the Man, but played drums <laughs> for thought- Oceana. Yeah, one or the other. No, no, he played drums and Behold the Man because he would destroy the whole set at the JCs. I feel like we're mixing this up. No, 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 we're not. We're not. We're not. We're not. Curly hair, Denny. He got best no, hair. I know. I know. I know. Yeah, I know yeah. what you're talking about. And he would like he would stake his snare or his his no his his floor tom. He would snake his floor tom and he would like throw it into the crowd for Behold the Man. Maybe. Yeah. 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 You might be right. He yeah. did play guitar for something else. Yeah. I th- I, he was in Oceana, but I. He played guitar for fucking. Nick would know. Nick would know. Well, he played guitar for Sacred too. Yeah. Nick would. Mm. So then he probably played yeah. Guitar he played for guitar. Oceana. Yeah. Sacred. That maybe that's what I'm thinking yeah. of, and I'm getting stuff well, mixed up. I, I I don't know Danny like you guys do, but I know Danny I don't know play guitar either. for Sacred. Yeah. I don't know him like that either, but Nick would know all that stuff. Yeah. They they you know, have, you're right on that. They all had long curly hair. Gorgeous guys. Pieces of shit. They're all pretty men. They're very beautiful. Pieces of shit. Yeah. What? Long curly hair. Fuck you. <laughs> Unoriginal content. <laughs> da, 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 da. What you got, Drew? Da, 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 da. Oh shit! Okay. Um. <laughs> Damn, I've already played all these bands. Let's do it. Fuck. The name of the band is Linger, and they're from Portugal. And I cannot find fuck about them on the internet. At Linger. All. This, this recording quality is good. This is what they're going for. This is good. I like this one. It's so, uh, it's so I, good. So it brings them the light, you know. <laughs> what are you talking about? This recording's fine. Different headphones. <laughs> <laughs> But you see what I'm saying? It reminds me of like early comeback kid, but it also gives me like a mid-career under oath. Like we're we're the full chorus, full singing. You know what I'm saying? Like it, it's, it's yeah, mid, mid 2000s, like you know. Yeah, it, when the post hardcore started blending with the you know the early metalcore stuff.
what I love about that song is uh, the name of the song is uh, "Do You Remember." Do you remember shows with head walking? <laughs> That's the name of the song. <laughs> yeah, I, not. The, uh, I'm sorry. What happened to the lost art of head walking? <laughs> oh, I see what you're saying. The yeah, lost like, art. That's yeah. hilarious. Well, that uh, that song is definitely it. I, I hear what they were going for. I'm like, that's what I want you to go for. Yeah. Fuck. No, it's really cool. Uh, yeah. It's super unique. It's good. And, and I, they're yeah. from Portugal. That's all I know about them. I can't find an instagram i can't find a facebook i can't find nothing that's why you're saying they won't get tagged because we won't be able to find there's no way they're gonna get tagged (laughs) (laughs) uh we'll probably accidentally tag another linger (laughs) yeah yeah um yeah that that was cool i like that it was super different it reminded me of a lot of um a cool way like do you did you ever listen to boy sets fire no okay so boy sets fire was like they kind of okay, so I can't remember if it's Boys Says Fire or at the drive in that became members of uh MGMT. I think it was I actually think it was um the drive in. I think it was at the drive in, yeah, you're right. Um not at wasn't was it MGMT not it was uh God damn it. Fuck. You know what I'm talking about. Huh? Get away. Yeah, that, that was at the drive in, but uh fuck, what band did they become that got like super Mars Volta, sorry. Okay. That yeah. So anyway, but it kind of gave me that blending of like uh so there was a lot of bands back in like the mid two thousand, early two thousands. You know that I was doing Boy Sets Fire at the drive in. But then you had like Emery that was kind of blending that that gap of like. Um, I'm gonna see him next week. Yeah. Oh, that's right. I thought that was tomorrow. Next week. Oh, is it next week? Oh, yeah. Then maybe I still buy tickets. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. I'm but actually it, really excited to see Emery. Uh, I never really got into him like in middle school and high school or anything. I'm only into one song. But I listened <laughs> to him recently. I'm like. This sounds like it should be in every song of Grind. Like it just it just sounds so good. Oh no, dude, they're a good, they're a killer fucking band. Like when I'm wa- curious what they sound like live now because it's you been heard, a while. You heard them live, Emery? Yeah. When? Uh, at the Taking Back Sunday show in Orlando. No. Yeah, they were there. No. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they they opened for them. Mm-hmm. I was I was there. No, you were there. Uh there's not a Taking Back Sunday show I typically miss. So like, uh, no, no, you were, you were, you were both there. You're both there. I'll have to look up the flyer. I'll, this sums I'll, up. I'll, I'll prove it to you. I'll prove it to you. No. Um. Anyway, but uh, Emery is like definitely more on the post hardcore slash, mm-hmm. you know, emo rock kind of thing. But man, when when that song Walls came out, I was oh, like, fuck, oh, dude. They, yeah. I don't. I'll argue with it. One of the hardest <laughs> breakdowns of all time, and I think I've showed you multiple times. Yeah. But goddamn, they opened up for um, Under Oath. Uh, at the social when I saw them, um, uh, and man, they were just, it was good. Yeah. It was good. I, I'm not a, like, you know, I, I had my stint of like the whole, what I don't like about like newer under it was two radio, like first chorus here. And that's cool. Whatever. Like the early stuff is what I fell in love you're not with. You're not a, you're not an alt rock kind of guy. No, no, I don't know. It depends on the band. Like I love, I, I love, uh, <laughs> uh, typo negative. Which is, is that goth? I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Is it metallic hardcore? Metallic hardcore. <laughs> I don't fucking know anymore, man. Let's go to uh, spiritofmetal.com. Yeah, we went to that show. No, I didn't. Yeah. You were there. No, okay. Okay. You're right. I was there. <laughs> no, 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 no. But hold on. But hold on. No, no hold on. Hold on. I, love, I was there, I uh-huh. but I miss Evergreen Terrace and Emery. I like literally showed oh, up. Showed up at the very end. Okay, at the very end. Okay, you're right. Okay. Fair you're enough, right. Fair Emery was like finishing up their mm. set when, yeah, yeah. Because like Dude, I went, they sound great. Yeah, they're great. They they were good. You're right. I will give you that. Uh, because I was really upset. I miss Evergreen Terrace because I haven't seen them in twelve years. Yeah, yeah. Um, but uh, yeah, at the Ace Cafe. Uh, Jake got us VIP. So like we had yep. to go through the the bar and we were like, what? And once we got everything situated, Emery was like literally finishing up their set. I was like, fuck. Okay. What the fuck is the Ace Cafe? So, okay. Remember where we Never stayed? Never heard of that. No, 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 no. We ate there. Remember where we stayed oh. at my birthday? Oh, the, yeah. yeah the, the, where we ate the, was right Ace by the Ca- highway. Right. Okay. So That's the Ace Cafe? Right. On the outside, there's a huge like kind of like a... Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah Okay. A lot, basically. Yeah. yeah I mean, it's got yeah. a big parking spot. Yeah. Right. So, yeah. No, we were there. We oh, okay. There. Oh, that, okay. Okay. Damn. All right. Yeah. I remember that now. Okay. Sorry. Cracking. <laughs> <laughs> what, are, what are we at on music? I don't know. We are at uh, nine songs and uh, minute thirty tight. Uh, One thirty six on the rec, but a minute thirty. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what? I play one more and then. Yeah, that's fine with me. I know, I know you want to try to keep it even, so. I do not care. 
I got I got two. I'm so fucking tired. Yeah, I feel it. I'm trying to stay awake. I feel it. No, it's okay. Um, <laughs> my last song of the night will be. This band's called Entrapment. <laughs> I'm a sovereign citizen. <laughs> You can't arrest me. What's your name? I don't have one. <laughs> and the song is called Hind- Hindsight. She deep. That's the voice you were thinking, right? Oh, God. It is the driver. I was like, it's I thought it'd be when I saw this band. Oh, I like that. It was great. It's amazing how just pause and it's just like why does that make me want to kill a human being? <laughs> right? Yeah, cool. Uh, (laughs) Nah, that was cool. I I like it because like that. It's like that, you know that that version of hardcore music now. But like the vocals wasn't what I was expecting at first. It was like almost like really, yeah, like that that very like low like in your face. No, no, no. I I get what you're saying. I mean, they they changed it up with the dynamic at the end of the song. I totally uh, totally get what you're saying, but it's like, I feel like we've listened to so much shit where I'm like, I don't, I mean, nothing's... When I heard the tone of the guitar at first, I'm like, okay, I kind of know it's going to be like maybe more mind forcey or like whatever. No, no, okay. That makes more sense. And then it it didn't. I was like, ooh, okay. It was more more mid-tony. Yeah, yeah. Because mind force is definitely kind of a higher pitched. Right. Yeah. yeah, So that makes sense. No, I'm just, I don't know if it's, we've just listened to a lot of like, bands on this podcast that I'm like, well, I don't, everything's been thrown at me from left field. I'm like, I don't know what the fuck to expect anymore. But no, yeah. I was fucking sick though. Yeah, that was cool. I like that a lot. Just your, dude, just kind of mixing it up. Just throw it in there. Throw it, just throw it in there. Throw the head in the fire. <laughs> uh, we now mentioned, <laughs> we now get to the point of the podcast where, Justin, are you playing, are you playing two songs today? Uh, Yeah, I'm going to play. Uh, yeah, well, we're going to, go he, he got a raise. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. <laughs> He did not submit the form to play two songs, but we're going to allow him to play two songs. Um, what you got for us, Justin? All right. So let me let me get this queued up yeah. real quick. No, no, no. Let me, oh, let me just. Kid, fuck you. You, took you, the, don't, you don't get to say that. You took this, taking, no, you took this band from me, shit, motherfucker. You've been taking shit from me all day. Dude, this band, dude, this band is so fucking good. Now do you see why I want to play two songs? Dude. Do you see why? RJ. He's right. <laughs> dude, this band is so fucking good, dude. Uh-huh. Oh. Yes, sir. So this is uh this is Connecticut Power Violence. This is uh Kidnapped is the name of the band. Wait, what did you call it? Connecticut, Connecticut Power Violence. Connecticut. I thought you said a kinetic power violence. I'm I like, thought that yeah, that's like, awesome. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's what you said. That's the name of the show. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> kinetic power violence. <laughs> uh but yeah, no, like this this band has a sick album out. And... Look at look at the laptop when you're talking. This band has a sick album out. <laughs> I can edit it. Just... And it's it's so good <laughs> that we have to play two songs just because dude. by the time you get into one of them, it's over and you need more. Dude, this band is so good. <laughs> you you have to have more. So the first um... song we're going to play is Disgust. The, s- the second song we're going to play is Blind Dogs. I'm going to try to make it as smooth as possible. We're just going to fucking rail it out, dude. Rail it out. Be real smooth. Yeah. Dude, rail it out. Dude, this, band, this band is so Everybody good. Everybody shut. Let's fucking... <laughs> to mess up my hair, dude. <laughs> Dude, 
This is so good. <laughs> I love this band. This is the song that I have to say. <laughs> this shit fuck! <laughs> Yes, yeah. Dude, this is so good. Can <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> that be fucking roll? <laughs> I had to play too. I had to play too. <laughs> So that was kidnapped, you fucks. It was okay. Yeah, very good. <laughs> <laughs> What's the ransom? Yeah. Dude. Anyway. Okay. Oh my god. Two things I love most about that band. One is not to a T. They're kinetic. <laughs> they are kinetic. Yes, they're always moving. Very good. Um, uh, they remind me of one of my favorite bands of all time, Suicide File. Not in the same vein of tonality, but. Just a chaos level, but, no, but just but, but, it, but they're just strumming, they're just strumming, yeah. and that's the cool part that I love about it. But it also like makes me like it makes me want to run after you to kill you. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like I, I, if you're in front of me, like you're mad, but like if I'm like mad enough to chase you, that's what's playing in my head. <laughs> it, um, it's so much fun, yeah. and it's crazy how much you can fit, how much fun you can fit into like a minute ten song, dude. That's the kind of fucking show. Okay. <sighs> Justin, actually, uh, pers- perfectly. Ceremony, that poster behind you. Dude, I saw Ceremony. Talk about headwalking, dude. Talk about headwalking. Dude, dude it's not even headwalking. They're, but talk it, about it. Dude, everybody is like fucking Sonic the Hedgehog spinning. Yeah. It, dude, it's insane. Yeah. I saw Ceremony one time. Really? And that guy is literally on the rafters. With like deep throating a microphone, screaming, yeah. kicking people as he's uh, really uh, ignoring the fire code, and I'm like, well, that's what that band is. Yeah, kidnapped. That's what your band is. That's that. That is like you must like see that. Live. No, hold on. I just that's to, wild. Just, dude. just to prove a yeah. point. Just to prove head a point. on a swivel. No one's safe. Just like <laughs> I love how you had that and I played it. I love. It. Well, the thing is, is I, it was on a different list, so that's where it <sighs> fucked me up, dude. <sighs> I'm pissed that it was the last thing to play because now I just want to listen to more me. Fuck. It's okay. It's not a big deal. <laughs> Hold on, but I, I did make a RJ. You like that shit? It was okay. Yeah, I love it. I just love that rock. That <laughs> rock and roll history. I want to rip this table apart. <laughs> yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. Oh, dude, rip it in the tear. Dude, dude we'll go listen to Kidnapped, it. everybody. Jesus. Wait, I'm in the wrong app. Hold on, I have to go to my spreadsheet. Jesus. Oh, yeah, that's man. that's real tough. How'd you find them, Justin? Uh, well, do, do you just wait till the you hear the bands in the couple weeks that I gave up to play them. Uh, I found them through my travels as, as usual. I <laughs> hate. Thank you, Oliver. That. Answer. I know. That's why I, say <laughs> I hate that answer so much. But okay, so you found it on Spotify. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Do you remember what band? Yes, I found them through Soul Thief, who's another band I'm going to play. So if you play them, you're an asshole. Got it. 
not gonna do it. Sword. But I, I have a I have a list here, <laughs> which okay. I found them through someone through someone I, through someone. I have a new spreadsheet name. called uh, New Band Loves. Uh, I'm gonna flash it just so. Yeah. Ooh. But uh, Ooh. but but they're number two. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Come to Florida with that kinetic sound. And it's not gonna flop if you come. Kid, to kidnap me. <laughs> Would you say he said okay, the music if I'm chasing after you and I want to kill you? Oh no no no! Like, there, like if I'm if I hear something so violent, I'm like ah. Oh. If you're right in front of me, like I'm like a gorilla. Like, <laughs> but like a gorilla that, with like, a morning star. Like, I'm gonna I'm gonna chase you <laughs> to make you feel all the pain that I feel every morning when I wake up, dude. Really? I will say this: it's not your fault. We're both not your fault. What? I'm not. I can run. I can't run long. I can't either. But I can run quick. Real short. So, like, my daughters, like... You're an Olympian. Yes. <laughs> I am an elite force of nature. Uh, <laughs> dude, when, yeah, I, when, when I dude, when I get going, because my, my oldest doesn't think I could, like, get her. Mm. It is the most terrifying. Me just... <laughs> just, like, just, just running after you, dude. It is terrifying. Mm. Dude, I remember my dad was the same way. My dad's always been a big guy. And then uh, I remember it was like 12 or something like that on my birthday. And he's like, I got 12 spankings for you. Like joking around. We had a big birthday party. And I was like, if you can catch me, he goes, start running. I remember running. Like there's no way my dad could catch me. And I look behind me and he's like, <laughs> like just bulldog. And he fucking grabs me. I'm like, oh my God. Vince Neil chasing you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh. Yeah, it, it was wild, dude. <laughs> the last dude. time I sprinted was to prevent a felony. <laughs> That's your true. own or someone else? No, I'm not saying it on the podcast. Yeah, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> you brought it up. So nah, well, I just, uh, you don't know. Find this part of the episode in the back rooms. <laughs> <laughs> Never go in the back rooms. <laughs> don't go there. Play this outro. <laughs> I was like, had my finger on the trigger. <laughs> That oh. might have been involved. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I love being off the rails. That's fun. True, I know you're what tired, you just but I got said another hour. Before I got is one of the time. most insanely idiotic Choke things I've ever six heard. More years. Hey. At no point <laughs> in your rambling, incoherent response were you even close to anything that could be considered a rational thought. Did I hit you? You got me in the chair. Everyone yeah. in this room is now dumb. <laughs> I did